After the whistleblower expose regarding Twitter, Elon Musk is now seeking to delay the court trial over his intention to back out of a $44 billion deal to buy Twitter until November. This after Musk's lawyer sent a fresh letter to Twitter to include the whistleblower's complaint as another reason to scrap the deal. More details coming up in this next report. With the trial looming, Elon Musk is redoubling his efforts to end his $44 billion deal to buy Twitter sending a new letter of deal termination to the social media firm, citing a recent whistleblower complaint from the former security head at the company. Last week, Peter Zatko, a famed hacker known as Mudge, who was fired by Twitter in January, said in his complaint that Twitter prioritized user growth over reducing spam and that the company falsely claimed it had a solid security plan. In the latest letter to Twitter, Musk and his legal team said that if the allegations are true, then Twitter has breached some of the provisions of the deal to buy the company. Musk has also subpoenaed Zatko, seeking information mostly about the way Twitter measures spam accounts. But Twitter shot back, saying in a regulatory filing that Musk's fresh termination notice was invalid and wrongful under the terms of the deal. The world's richest person decided to spike the deal to buy Twitter in July, saying the company misled him and regulators about the true number of spam or bot accounts on the website. But Twitter says Musk can't just walk away. The two sides are scheduled to battle it out in court in a five-day trial in Delaware set for October 17th. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.